And new at 11, an unlicensed contractor is out of work behind bars and no stranger to crime. In fact, Jose Rivera has been arrested at least two other times for scamming customers. And as our Josh Cassio tells us, unlicensed contractors are a big problem. New at 11. Detectives here at the Sarasota County Sheriff's Office tell us unlicensed contractors are a big problem here in Florida. The Belo Volano Condo Complex, which is about 20 minutes away from the Sheriff's Office, found that out the hard way. Erin Holdgate is feeling a bit cold after learning one of the contractors at her condo complex had no license to do any of the AC work. Honestly, I'm pretty shocked. Juan Rivera was busted by Sarasota County deputies charged with 33 counts of felony unlicensed contracting. He was hired by Bella Villano to do repairs and HVAC work. They paid him eight grand. When the management asked if he was a licensed contractor, he said yes. Whenever they asked for his copy of his license and or for certification, he would come up with excuses. Turns out this guy is experienced in this line of illegal work. This is his third arrest for it. A little bit of research would have revealed yeah. some very valuable information, I think. Detectives in Sarasota have been cracking down on unlicensed contractors. They're part of a 25-member task force fighting it. Well, it could cost you double in the long run by not hiring a licensed individual to begin with. Here's what to look out for. It's always a buyer beware. Just because somebody tells you they're licensed doesn't mean they're licensed. They should be able to show you a card that says they're state certified. Which you can verify through the state or county. In Rivera's case, he worked at Bella Volano from February. February last year to June, right under their noses. Is it sad that people are out there doing things like that? That should be like the number one thing that you check is licensed, you yeah. know? We left messages for the management company, but so far we have not heard back. As for Rivera, he's in jail tonight on $17,000 bond. In Sarasota, Josh Cassio, Fox 13 News.